quick shout out to the best English teacher I've ever had, Miss Graham. <laughs> Finding validation in ornithology. My therapist recently suggested that I may be bipolar, and it's not that fact that kills me, it's the fact that I think I'm the only other person that believes it. People think they see every piece of me, though that is possible for no one. All of this on top of being major depressive, socially and generally anxious, agoraphobic, and attention to fit. Fun fact! Birds can migrate due to a part of their brains that detects the Earth's magnetic pull. They don't know where the fuck they're going, they're just pulled. <laughs> I'm being pulled, and I don't know where the fuck I'm going. I know where I'd like to go, but where? what are the chances that I'll get there a light? Fun fact. Cardinals sometimes cover themselves in crushed or living ants, smearing them or letting them crawl amongst their feathers. Some scientists believe that the birds use the formic acid secreted from this process to rid themselves of parasites. I am no stranger to fighting fire with fire. In middle school, I, like the cardinal, would depend on something that slit, I mean bit, and stung to rid myself of infestations. Fun fact, I bet you knew this already, but most birds are scared very easily. This makes them tricky to hunt. Right now, I'm scared because people keep getting my hopes up, up to manic levels. When I'm up, I'm up. Grotesque fantasies about going out in a shocking explosion of blood and feathers where everyone has to see. The fact that anyone can make me fly that idiotically high makes me want to molt my own skin. People keep proving to me that what goes up must come down, but I don't come down. I plummet like a game bird a shot from the sky. Fun fact, birds have thin hollow bones. This allows efficient flight. This also means that birds are incredibly easy to break, to snap into. I'm always snapped into. If you want a songbird, I'll be your canary. I'll tweet my fast beating heart out on my last breath, but please don't cage me, and I beg you, please be wary of my hollow bones. Thank you.